what it looks like to play Gorilla Tag upside down. I ask people for 10 challenges, and if I can't complete 9 out of 10 of them, that's what I have to do for a week. Now, this raises a multitude of questions. One of them being, why am I doing this? The answer is, I'm not sure if I'm capable at Gorilla Tag. So if I can't prove myself, then I'll have to do the upside down walk of shame for a whole week. And thus... Okay, so usually I'd be using a disguise, but uh, that bit's kind of old. Hey guys, it's me, <gasps> Kane East. Now that I had my disguise, it was time for the first challenge, which honestly was the hardest thing I've ever done in Gorilla Tag ever. First challenge is to get out of the map. First, you come to stump like this, and then you just walk out. Is it that crazy? I mean, <laughs> I may have exaggerated that just a bit. Okay, next challenge. I have to get five people to give me a thumbs up after they tag me in comp queue. Now, this one was going to be a challenge because I don't know if you've ever played Gorilla Tag, but a lot of the community is not very nice. Regardless of this, I joined the first lobby. I then realized that this was a casual lobby and left swiftly. Things were already not going my way. I joined the second lobby and hunted down the last player. GG! The round restarted, and now it was my turn to run, and hopefully get tagged and get a thumbs up. Now, it couldn't be too obvious that I was looking to get tagged, but I couldn't find the lava monkey anywhere. Where's the tag guy? Whilst I was running around looking for him, it looks like he found me instead. Come back. GG. We had one of the five required thumbs up. I joined a new lobby and finished up the round, at which point it was time to learn the lava monkeys with my trademark technique. Hey! <laughs> GG. Another thumbs up secured. I joined a new lobby, got two more thumbs up, and it was time for the final one. I joined a new public and walked around looking for the final guy. That's when I spotted him from the tree stump. Hey, there he is! Everybody kill his whole family. How could this be? He spawned right next to me. If I don't move, maybe he won't- Yay! That was challenge number two. So far, we're doing really good, but I doubt that it's gonna stay that way. You see, the next challenge is I have to find the Gorilla Tag one year anniversary badge in a random public lobby. Now, it's been two years since then, so this is by far going to be one of the hardest. Find the GT1 badge. I know how to do this. I join City and look for the oh so rare badge. Hey, does anybody here have the Gorilla Tag one year badge? I don't believe it's real. I had no luck in City and proceeded to Forest. Hey, 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 does anybody here have the GT one year badge? You have the two year I one. I need the one year one. Hey, why do you sound familiar? I you may have heard of me. I am Kane East. Like Lobby one wasn't helpful, so I joined another. Do, you, do either of you have the GT1 year badge? Wait, show me. I'm just kidding. Just when I thought that all hope was lost. Hey, does anybody here have the GT1 year badge? Well, show me, please, I beg you. I need to see a picture of it. <laughs> That's not the GT1 year badge. That's the early access badge. Sorry, wait. 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 Thank you! That's perfect! Thank you, Rizzo! Okay, we were almost halfway done, but the next challenge would be the most nerve-wracking yet. I have to survive in the swamp for five minutes. Now, that doesn't sound like a very long time, until you realize five minutes is more than double the length of a regular gorilla tag lobby. Hey, pal! You better stop that! After tagging the last guy, it was time for me to survive. Okay, it's 12.17, so at 12.22, I will have win. I ran around for a while dodging the lava monkey until I had a horrible idea. A brilliant, horrible idea idea. If I can survive five minutes in a big tunnel map, I can survive in the swamp map. Now, I don't know about you, but I don't like being upside down, so I was willing to do anything it took, including waiting in this corner. I was a complete sitting duck, so if anybody jumped over this ledge, I would be toast. It's only been one minute. How am I the last one? I'm genuinely terrified right now. And there's freaking birds chasing me. I started to hear footsteps right behind me. All it would take would be someone to jump down and look behind them, and the jig would be up. Luckily, they dissipated, but a new issue would soon arise. Oh, hi! With only one minute left, all I had to do was survive. Get the frick away from me, man! Get the frick away! Get the frick away from me! Hi, guys! You guys look like little freaking ants from down here. Up here. Oh, how did I live? <laughs> okay, you can tag me. And just like that, 4 out of 10 of the challenges were done. The next challenge was absolutely diabolical. I had to make people in a public lobby join a random gorilla tag code and then never actually show up. I am so sorry. Do you guys want to play, uh, play a special mini game for Swamp? Come on, come on, come on, come on. It's just really fun. It's really fun. It's, it, you can do a glitch and then it makes the game so much more fun. Join the code jungle. J-U-N-G-L-E. Jungle. Code jungle. Okay. Let's go. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. What's the code? What's the code? No, I just I just wanted to trick them. I just thought it would be funny. I just I just tricked them. Okay. I'm the ultimate Decepticon. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs>
up. Not all of these are straight up physical challenges. This one was more of a test of how far I was willing to go. And dude, I don't like playing upside down. So at the detriment of multiple poor souls, it was time to move on to the sixth challenge. Okay, next one. Go grab Matt the bat and make him disappear. With my goal in mind, I joined a public caves lobby. Guys, 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 I'm here on a quest. I'm here on a quest. I'm on a quest, guys. I need the bat. Where's the freaking bat at? Red, do you know where the bat is? For some reason, the people in this lobby just acted like I didn't exist. I have to find the bat as fast as possible. Where is he? I just came into you know this what? lobby. I hear it. You, what? I was genuinely so confused. The sound was coming from right next to me, but I didn't see him anywhere. I know where he is. I know where he is. Where? Kanye East. Yeah. He's yeah. <gasps> I see him. Okay, now I have to make him disappear. This would prove to be the difficult part, as making things magically disappear is not easy. Goodbye. I have to make him disappear. I have to make him disappear. I have to make him disappear. I had a theory that if I took him up, he might disappear out of my hand. I have to make him disappear. Goodbye, Matt the Bat. <laughs> and with that magical disappearance, another challenge was completed. We are literally only three away from finishing. But if I miss just two of these, it's over. For the next challenge, I have to learn something I don't know from somebody in a public lobby. Now, I've been playing this game for almost three years. There's almost nothing that I don't know. So this is going to be incredibly challenging. Hey, does anybody here have some very niche, like, gorilla tag tips? I know Oh, really? Where, 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 where? Um, I'll put on YouTube. Okay, that's not gonna be helpful. This is one of the many times that somebody didn't actually have anything, which was not what I was expecting to be the main challenge. Where's the one that's the I, that's me. So when you come up the walls, you wanna push it? No, it, it has to be something I don't know. Yes. I thought it was over, but then I finally had some luck. Do you know how to backwards, um, backwards elevator? I do not, I do not. Follow, 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 follow. So basically, you know how normally you elevator like this, right? Yeah. Put one arm through, and then put the other arm through, and then you start climbing up. Oh, Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. I didn't know that you could use two arms. This is kind of confusing. That's super janky, actually. Wait, let me try to do that better. <laughs> It's hard to do when you first out for wow, that actually is really fast. I'm gonna master this. I'm gonna master this way. I spent the rest of this lobby trying to practice this technique and eventually got it to a passable point. I did it. I had managed to learn something new and it was time to move on to the eighth challenge. Okay, I have to do a stick justice, even though I don't have stick. If you don't know what a stick justice is, it's basically when a moderator goes around and finds toxic people and then reports them. Instead, <laughs> yeah, yeah. See, I'm a gorilla tag stick, guys. I joined the lobby and started looking for cheaters. Is there any- is there any toxic people in here? Okay, buddy. Guess what? I'm a gorilla tag stick. You're banned. I have to report you. Uh, report! I had put a gorilla tag lunatic to justice, and it was time for the final and hardest challenge. This challenge would seal my fate. Would I win? Would I lose? It was all up to this. Needless to say, that stressed me out. Okay, so for the final one, I have to go to every map in 60 seconds. I don't even know if that's possible. Luckily, I have a stopwatch. I did a multitude of test runs, but just couldn't seem to break it. But regardless, I continued. Three, two, one, go. City. Now, in order for it to even be possible, I had to alter the challenge a bit. I don't have to step foot in every map, it just has to be loaded in. Caves, canyons, forest, I forgot swamp, beach. Unfortunately, the clock hit one minute before I could reach swamp. I attempted again and again and again until finally, three, two, one, go. City, mountains. Clouds. Forest. Caves. Canyons. I have 10 seconds to make it to the entrance of beach. Please. Beach! 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 Yes! I made it! Hooray! And thus, I had proven myself as a Gorilla Tag player. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe. Thank you for watching.